On May 17, Discord.js released version 13.7.0 with model support. If you don't know, model is a dialog box that appears in the current window. It can contain buttons, menus and text fields. Now the question comes up, why use them? Well, models are pretty good if you want to create a form or create suggestion, feedback, report, etc. types of commands. Now that we know how impressive models are, let's dive into the video because I'm about to show you how you can create an embed command with models from scratch. First of all, start the project and install the required packages. The settings.json file contains bot token and master guild. Well, master guild is just an ID of the guild where we will create our slash commands. Index.js, this is the main file. I imported some classes of discord.js and the required values of settings.json. This command directory will contain slash commands and to be more specific, embed command that we are creating. Ready event with a simple start message. In interaction create event, we will check whether the interaction is a command and proceed based upon it. Now that we have completed the basic setup, we need to create an embed command. I hope you know slash command builder, a tool that allow you to create slash commands without having to construct objects manually. You simply initialize the model class and assign custom names and IDs to the model elements. A model consists of several components and within each component is an action row. This row can contain text field, buttons and select menus. Each action row can contain a single text field. Let's go ahead and add fields for description and color. In order to show model, you can use interaction.showModel. We are done with command but we also need to create a slash command in the master kit. To do this, I will go to the package.json file and create another script where I will set the build env variable to true and run the main file. In the ready event, I will be checking whether env.build is true and if it is, then proceed further. Time to run bot and see how it goes. I will use npm rem tab because I want to create slash commands while running bot. As you can see it looks amazing but when I click on submit button it gives error. That's because we have showed model but never received the request of model when submitting it. To achieve this we will just add another if statement to the interaction create event. Check if interaction custom id is embed then get model input details and create embed according to it. Finally, send it. 